This is a special shout out to executive producer Jojo77. Thank you so much. We really appreciate your sponsorship. Welcome back to another EP sponsored reaction. This one is for Broad Church Season 3, Episode Number 1. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell as well. Tell a friend to keep telling people that the algorithm is working. Uh, oh, and thank you. Shout out to executive producer JoJo for sponsoring this reaction. Let's get to the opening episode of Season 3 of Broad Church right now. Police, you called for an attack? Sexual attack? Okay. We'd like to take you somewhere where we can talk. It's just a short drive away, is that alright? Go. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. This is Lee. Leah. Leah. She's, she's a girl. Really you play her. She's too bad tomorrow. Okay, don't worry about that for now. What about Leah's dad? We're, we're separated six months. So you're not nearby? We're going to need his details. Make a cup of tea, Asa. Alright, calm down. I was like, can you, you take it? Calm down, shit. Like, slow the fuck down. Why you need me? I'm the delicate hand. Right. He's a battle axe. He's babe. a diesel, baby. He's a diesel. That's <laughs> what he is. <laughs> He's calm down. Look, I need you to take your diesel ass. Yeah. And sit your ass down. <laughs> Yeah, of course I checked the locks. Goddamn, it's the Did you look at her phone? This is the charger. It was right there. Jeez. 
didn't even take, take it with her. I feel like I just started yesterday. Well, you know we lost the case. So, I mean, and it took you like two years for yours. So, I'm just... Can we get it right the first time? Are we throwing around? shots all the time? <laughs> Just let's not fuck this one up. Let's get this one right out of the gate. Where's the tea? Every time. Make the tea first and then do your nosing around. Yeah. Yeah, he got the nosing all the way through, babe. It's like when he started cleaning. It's like, oh shit, here goes babe. <laughs> <laughs> Tornado. <laughs> Well, unless the attacker's got a key. How's she doing? She said her name on No, not yet. I mean, she can't remember. She's just not going to tell her. Well, she's still in shock. We've got to give her some time. We're not half time. She was attacked by a stranger. Other people could be at risk. All right, I know. You have to take a look at the calendar. I'll just say that. If the injuries are two days old, it takes you back to Saturday. How about it's 50th? Yeah. Can you explain why she's so reluctant to talk about it? Does anyone else have keys? Um, Annie, um, neighbour two doors down. Uh, also, Kath, my mate. We saw that you had an invite to Kath's party last Saturday. Did you go to that church? Is that why the attack happened? Does she know who it is? Is she so just... during the party or after? Was it someone at the party? Um, I was outside. And someone hit me in the back of the head and knocked me out. Cat's party was... Saturday nights, now Tuesday morning. So, what did you do between Saturday night and reporting the attack last night? I came home. Where did you get home? I think I walked. From where you woke up at the party? But you don't know where that was exactly? It's just by the water. What sort of water? Do this now. It's okay, you're doing really well. Yeah, it's gonna be one of those do we believe her first or then? So, uh, after you got home, what did you do then? I, I just lay on the bed as I thought. If I just lay there, maybe it'd go away. And Trish, the clothes we took from you yesterday, are they not the clothes you wore when you were attacked? Oh. No. Hey, what well, have you done with those clothes? clothes? Well, I threw them in the corner of my room. When we're done here, we'll go to the party location. So you realize all the evidence we packed up yesterday was able to tell the shit. I mean, at least she didn't, it doesn't seem like she took a shower, so at least she might still have evidence kind of like so when they were waiting. Tell her we're not very well and you need some days. My mate, she works there too. She'll she'll want to know what's happened. I'll sort you, don't worry. Do I get it. police protection? No, sorry. Is there anyone I can call to come be with you? No. A friend or a relative? Because you're not unique. Ooh, you look snappy. Okay. Don't want anyone knowing. Chris, you need support, you can't be on your own. I am. I just am. I, sh I shouldn't really do this, but um, I'm going to give you my number, <laughs> okay? Anytime you want to talk, you need anything, day or night. It's like empty, babe. Right. Thanks. 
Don't tell him I gave you that. Thank you. You must be exhausted. How are you feeling? Dirty. We will need you to come in and make a full statement as soon as you're ready. Okay. But you'll hear from your ace for soon. You've got your panic alarm. The police can be here really quickly and no one will mind you using it. Thank you. See you soon. see where this takes us because we already know how this is going to go with the aka roller coaster of this damn show the emotions are going to start to kick in at some point i don't know but i know the writing is going to be off the chain and the acting is going to be even better what are we going to get into with this rate i don't know but right now we got a damn uh um serial rapist on the loose supposedly well, we don't know if he's serious we don't know yet but i mean He's that seemed premeditated. Yeah, that seemed very premeditated. And then this party that happened, so there's going to be a whole bunch of in-betweens that's going on, and I'll be here for all that. So, uh, hey, I appreciate you uh, picking another season for us to watch because, you know, I'm addicted to this show and the two actors. I'm glad they both came back to, Me to too. be the detectives on there. And I see that they got a little team now, so which is good because we got to have a little bit of rules now to try to pay, play fair because we know what happened last time. Everything got to be by the book by the time we get back to court. And we know who the lawyers are going to be because we've seen that in the last one. So let's I go. I mean, if we even go to the court. If we, look, if we just solve it and we actually get a guilty person that want to stay guilty, then yeah, okay, we ain't got to go back to court. But I'm, I'm here for all that drama and let's get it. Season 3, thank you. Shout out again to executive producer JoJo for sponsoring this reaction. I'm so excited. I think this is the final season, if I'm not mistaken. Maybe not. Um, but I'm obsessed with this show, so I love the fact that we got to end season two and jump into season three in the same month. That rarely happens, so really appreciate both sponsors coming through this month, mm -hmm. uh, specifically for the opening of this season. So this is the first time where we've had a victim that's able to speak for themselves because that wasn't the case in the previous yeah. two seasons. Um, in both seasons, because both the girls were killed and, you know, in the first uh, the first season obviously he was mm -hmm. killed so this is the first time we've had a victim be able to speak so that's going to change the dynamic of the show a lot more because like as her memories start coming in mm -hmm. but then you know there's always like this like little nag in the back of my head like is she lying is yeah. there like is a conspiracy yeah them? um and i do get like this whole like vibe that the party wasn't all that it's supposed to be either that there's probably some shenanigans happening there i get like the eyes wide shut type vibe mm -hmm. um so like even seeing the condoms in this car was likely because like they're out swinging and yeah. they always got condoms so like but the show does such a great job of making you not trust anybody <laughs> like you're like they're all guilty oh, yeah. all of them oh yeah um but i like the setup i i'm so glad uh alec and ellie are back together again i'm it's three years passing so like it's been some time since uh since everything that we saw has happened uh, Mark and Beth aren't together anymore, but Beth's going to be involved with the victim, so we still get to see how the aftermath of everything that's happened impacts that family dynamic still, so that's interesting. Uh, but all in all, I honestly just wish we could watch the next episode. I just want to see how it all plays out, because I know it's going to be brilliant, and I'm yeah. here for all of it. So thank you again for sponsoring this episode, JoJo. I uh, hope we get to check out the next one soon. Yep. All right, well, look, thank you guys again for watching another EP sponsored reaction for Broad Church Season 3, Episode Number 1. And until next time, peace.